You know, I'm starting to think he's got me on a wild goose chase down here. Some sort of final hazing before I take my post on the Armitage. Wouldn't that be something if he did? Nah, who am I kidding? That would require Hubline to have a sense of humor. You know, you're gonna miss that logic around here. So you think there's any way to maybe convince him to not do this culinary thing? No, I don't think so. But he knows he has a place on the splashdown if he so chooses. Yeah. She's a good ship. So, what's the word on this anomaly you all have me investigating? Didn't we learn our lesson from Blubbitz? Ha ha! There's nothing concrete on our sensors. All our scans are being reflected back. Natural or...? Hubline hasn't ruled out anything yet. There's just not enough information. That's why I say, keep on your toes. Wait, hold on. Eric? Minard? What's he doing there? Not sure. Martinez. Hawkins. Nemster. Gartrell. Now that you're all here, I'll give you the assignment. The Constar has no dilithium, and the orbit is decaying. We have less than an hour, so find the dilithium. With no scanner? You must be joking, right? Actually, no. This is my joking face. Now this is my serious face. Find the dilithium. Permission to speak. So much of our time has been spent on this Tantalus receiver, on these Federation colonies, that we've lost sight of our mission. And you don't think I know what I'm doing? Is that it? Stealing technology has done nothing for the rebellion back home. Who do you think you're talking to? Let me tell you something, coward. While you were back home killing people, I was inspiring a rebellion that was fighting a war that would last for generations. The moment you doubt that is the moment you can take me on. Tell me, Jay. Is that moment today? Mm, no. Good. Then you all have an empire to rebuild. My heart serves the empire. I don't care about your heart. Just find the dilithium. Yes, sir. Now. Go. All of you. Kyle and I found something. So Mr. Gartrell's delusions came in useful. One of the perks of being an outcast. We each have a job to do. Yours is to scan the little things. Mine is to find people like you and crush them. Yes, sir. What did you and Mr. Gartrell find? So I've been monitoring the system that Kyle came up with. I've been tracking the calm logs and the dilithium flow. And it showed the same signature. That by itself wasn't bad. Until we got to the surface. Who was on the call? Dusty. The one who's jealous of Ella? That's the one that doesn't joke much either. But Kyle took some research using this database from the Federation. From Arturus. What did he find out? That he's not human. I see. A 
Cardassia. So who's helping him? Oh, he'll love this. It's time. We do good together. Yes, we do. Well, that certainly isn't Menard. Who is it then? I don't know. Changelings, maybe. But that Menard's talking about the Constar, and you and I both know that ship went down years ago. Either way, I think we just found out who's been stealing all that Federation tech from those colonies. I alert Starfleet at once. They're here for Dalithia. But that Menard says that his ship's in orbital decay. It should burn up in the atmosphere in less than an hour. Which means they're on a tight schedule. Commander, we're picking up very minimal dilithium and not enough to get an exact lot. Stay on these people and make sure they don't get their hands on any. Aye aye, sir. Mitchell out. Are you sure you still have it? Dad? When you got to this side, what did you hope to accomplish? And now you have an insurrection right under your nose again. I will deal with him as I see fit. And how will you deal with him? However I want. You know, it really doesn't matter what you want. <laughs> now this is starting to sound like my wedding day. Remember when I told you that you would need to grow up? And yet here you are, still running like a child. That's the difference between you and me. You ruled with an iron fist and veiled. I know how to strategize and come back. So that's why the Terran Empire fell. Why Spock beat you. You simply don't know what you're talking about! You blame Brousseau for helping him. But he was just one man. Just one ship. Just like Hawkins is one man. On your ship. You don't know what you're talking about! I'll show you all! Go ahead, Captain. What's going on at your end, Commander? Don't ask. But the sooner we get out of here, the better. What do you have? Commander, the anomaly has vanished from our sensors. Do you think their ship got vaporized in the atmosphere? It's hard to be sure with all their strange cloaking technology. But we're not picking up any traits of them at all. Best to stay until their window closes, just to make sure they don't get off the planet. Shouldn't we transport them? I'm sure the real Menard would have a lot of questions for these guys. We're still not picking up any life signs except yours. Whatever cloak they used for their ship, they must be using it to mask their life signs as well. <sighs> Wonderful. Something tells me we're dealing with things very much out of our depth. We'll leave a probe behind to monitor things while we get word to Starfleet. If they find any dilithium, though... Don't worry. I've got that covered. Good. But keep your distance, Commander. You're no match for all of them. So Mr. Gartrell's given me information that I'm now required to handle in the most efficient way possible. People today call everyone their friend. So when you finally meet someone that you actually bond with, it often goes unheard. I want you to know exactly what you mean to me. You are my friend, Daniel. And you're mine, Eric. What you've done betrays the Empire and what it stands for. I can't let that stand. You been a liar and a thief all your life. Your war has wiped us out. After Wolf 359, the Terrans could have chose 
any leader in the universe. They chose me. Do you really wonder if I'm any good? Tell me, do you really wonder? You've been no leader to us. <laughs> Don't be deceived by my cushy appearance. You know, we can fix everything. It's not too late. Life's too short. Your life is short. I thought you were my brother. <laughs> I hope you die. See, the thing about me is... There aren't enough prayers in the universe to give me redemption. was a mistake. How? Who are you? Shouldn't you know? Donovan, isn't it? I don't know how you know my name, but you are not Eric Menard. Ah, now that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Why don't you come down here, and we can talk? Nah, I'll pass. That's probably wise. Tell me, military man, why are you alone down here? Who said I was alone? Do you know what they call me where I'm from? I'm the Phantom. Cute name. What's it mean? No one escapes from me. They can try. But they always fail. Where are you from? What do you want? I want the voice of Menard out of my head. I want to destroy the Federation piece by piece. Where I'm from, you couldn't save your family. Wouldn't it be a shame if they suffered the same fate again? You have a daughter. Janessa, isn't it? She cried out for you. You were a coward then. And you're a coward now. You! We're just to Mitchell. No one knows his clothes. Repair for transport. Hear that, Phantom? Your ships burn up. The only thing getting destroyed is your hope of getting out of here. I mean, it has to be, right? Some dark mirror version of Menard? You know, Starfleet has records going back 100 years about this Terran Empire. Makes you wonder what happened there. Donovan? Sorry, Captain. I'll be right up to the bridge. I just, uh, I mean, permission to Take all the time you need, Commander. Thanks, Aurora. Commander Mitchell out. 
computer. Call home. Hey, sweet pea. Are you coming home soon? No. I'm not coming home just yet. I just, uh, really needed to hear your voice. Like the evil of men, I'm deceiving you, leaving you dead when I flow with medieval intent. Feel no need to intervene or step in my arena. F around, get eaten. I am a hyena, top of the food chain. I'll never relent. There's no talking me off of this ledge. I'ma die in the throne like Saddam and Assad and Haddafi. I'm bombing these foes and I'm off with the heads to the guillotine. Cause I'm a killing speed like the military of Philippines. The superhuman ability filling me as a real MC. I'm a milliliter, millisecond, millimeter from becoming even iller than a till of the heart. When it will, I turn into a f gorilla. Got till of the will of beast. Ain't nobody can really be in vicinity. My enemies coward, the Yahweh, the divinity. Power, devour the cowards, cause y'all are mini me. So let it be known that when I make flows, I got infinity stones cause I'm Thanos. The Federation ship has left orbit. I was wondering when they would leave. Do you have the dilithium that you need? Martinez sent it up 20 minutes ago and we are fully primed. Oh, and Captain, that ship, they left us a gift. Did they now? A fresh probe to pick apart. Well then. Let's go see what's next on our agenda.